Welcome back to School of Civil Engineering. This is Heather Tulla with another new video. As we have started Tech Lab software learning uh, tutorial series, and uh, I have told you that in this, uh, I mean, in this series, I will just discuss about Tech Lab Connection Designer 2019 software, and also I'll show you that how we'll use that software. So, uh, to use that software, I can, uh, I mean, uh, we can directly use that software you know that we can cannot directly use that software we have to we need some partial software like uh, tecla instructional designer tecla portal frame designer and tecla connection designer so if you're new to our channel you can watch our previous video that how to download that software and install that software and also how we'll get uh, its update and also they have many video about tecla instructional designer tecla portal frame uh, designer and also have design RCC building by using Tecla structural designer and also is still structured by using Tecla structural designer and also have design portal frame by using Tecla portal frame designer so uh, today I mean in this video I'm just going to discuss about or showing you about that how will design I mean how design some connection of our still a structure frame okay so let's start for that first of all we have to open tecla portal frame designer just double click here so here is your tecla portal frame designer and when you know that um, our tecla portal frame designer tutorial series i have discussed i i have my model and create a tecla structural designer sorry uh, i mean i have uh, design and model a portal frame by using tecla portal frame designer so i'll just click here open and from here this is the portal frame okay uh, i have created i'll open that so just see that this is our portal frame this is our portal frame and uh, after that i'll just see here loading we have no uh, loading available here i'll just here I'll just add that loading okay then will be but actually I'm just giving that value and already I have uh, done in my previous video you can watch that I'm just going first here finish after that I'm add then okay. um, actually I have done everything in here that's why I'm just going first finish then okay it's done after that design wizard it's also okay design group so from here mm, external column so from here raster and from here internal column then, okay after that i will go here had design code also it's okay now i'll go here portal frame so a portal frame are failing in here so i'll just close that and i'll click here i'll just change the section wm section and from here i'll get trace six section okay so first one first one section here actually uh, I'm just uh, doing that what I have done in my previous video actually so I have forgotten to save that file that's why it's not saved here so I'll just come here w72 w2 it's okay and okay after that I'll go ahead design so it's passed okay done so we are uh, actually here we have done mm, done that now I will show you about that how we'll go for our portal frame I mean portal connection designer software by using that portal frame I mean how will uh, they have a connection 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 you know that so we'll design every connection one by one by using 
Tecla Portal Frame Designer with respect to Tecla Connection Designer 2019. Okay, so first of all, I'll just go ahead design and update design. It's done, and I'll check here. So uh, it's done. If you see here, just click connection and see here. Oh, ls if. So I'll just uh, right click and click here export connection. Okay, right click and export connection. And before that, I mean before uh, export that ensure that if install Tecla connection designer and uh, if you are Tecla user then you know that you cannot use more than one software in Tecla software. I mean you can at a time. So uh, I have found that solution and also that video are available in our um, channel so please watch it after that export connection just wait and click here I mean click down in the new launch software take like connection designer otherwise you can just minus it here here so it's okay after that so here uh, Tecla connection designer okay so just here you are seeing that this is your AVE I mean this is our left left side AVE so we'll just design that by using Tecla connection designer 2019 all right so for that just uh, right click on it right click on it and take connection just click here and see that everything is okay except welding so close that after that right click edit connection so actually oh uh, it is very easy now here is our uh, column section so we'll do not anything here after the we'll go face c so we'll not will not work i mean will not work here we'll work in face a okay so in, in face a here is the beam also we'll don't do anything here after that will go here hunt they have two options they have uh, type non or bolt okay so they have hunts or uh, will also don't do anything here because uh, already we have passed that section so this is the in plate this is the important thing and will work here in our implant in plate so Here, uh, if you see that this is the implant, implant width, and our implant is not same as that. So I'll just increase that implant 180, then 250, like that. Just I'll go here uh, 200. This is also not okay. See that actually this it's okay, but uh, implant it's not. Uh, like as our after thickness okay so uh, here just see and I will prepare 3 25 okay now it's done so this is our uh, inflate here it's done now and here also the thickness you can see that then it's okay then the flash this distance is uh, known as flash it's 20 uh, I'll just give 25 so 25 just see here and here also I'll increase for bottom 25 it's done after that I will go bolt layout so this is the most important part of connection designer bolt layout so from here this is the first object row this 17 uh, the 70 here is the 70 then row this is the one row one row and piece so I will use uh, three row here okay so I will use three row and uh, I will give it okay it's 90 okay otherwise I will use two row and I will give on to zero piece one two zero piece okay so if i give a 90 just see here after that they have one piece here i mean one uh, row here okay so it's okay i will use one row here that uh, it's have no problem after that i will go here bolt so from here you have to just select the bolt a uh, grid so from here i will just select uh, 8.0 8.8 grid and size m20 and our then whole size will be 22 i mean uh, in every set it will be one millimeter one millimeter more than its uh time i mean its radius okay so after that it goes 
this is the 90 millimeter it's done after that welding here uh, welding will will just press press I mean press apply and we see that is it okay or not so it's, we are showing that it's I mean in weld it's failing for and for every where it's passing so I just click here and see that compression planes weld hounds bottom planes hounds bottom planes are failing compression planes weld so I will change that again I will come here as the planes and for bottom it's failing so I'll just into the distance actually I'll cancel that and I'll apply that sorry I'm extending uh, it's 10 I will use here 8 then press ok after that I will apply that and actually I actually I'll see here by double clicking here what is the issue here so just see here fill welded 8 millimeter but required is 8.8 .8. So just press OK, then press OK, then close that, and from here I will just change it. Oh, 10, okay, 10 millimeter leg length. And then I'll just press apply. Just see that it's OK. Okay. So our, I mean our connect our connection check for S pen one. I mean S pen uh, leg side. Uh, sorry uh, left side apes its design is okay just a closer and actually you can change that value into the bolt connection and you can design that as much as economical by using that software okay so just uh, then press ok then close it's done just see here now and here is the connection okay here is the connection here actually so this uh, red marker representing the here if I move that here if I zoom it that marks are representing that if it's representing welding okay it's representing welding and uh, this is the bolt actually here this is representing welding and this is the bolt actually here so in this way we can design our span apes and uh, for right if try by yourself in same way okay so now I'll just show you that how we'll find out its uh, model so just click here right click and from here open 3d view this is the 3d view then again here right click and open 2d view just see here this is the 2d view and uh, from here actually you can see that what is the what is uh, required for where and just here is this the inlet section and here is the bolt uh, and here is the piece everything in 2d diagram everything is available here and here is showing 0 0.8 okay and only in here it's showing 0 point I mean 1 point uh, 10 millimeter here it's showing 10 millimeter fillet otherwise everything is I mean every um, joint welding is 0, uh, 8 millimeter so I think uh, it's clear to you and also if I show you just right click now suppose you need that file in AutoCAD okay you need that file in AutoCAD just right click here and export DXF just and save that file here to 0 0.02 apps Tecla connection designer okay then save it then it's done so if I go here uh, go here document so from here if I open that see. Just opening see what happened actually here uh, just see here here is your AutoCAD value and also can, uh, you can change its color here just from here uh, here it's you can change its color from here actually so by just click here uh, double click clear and from here you are able to change its color so 
so I'll close that and also the AutoCAD tutorial are available in our channel so if you think that that is helpful for you there's the like button and also leave a comment share our video and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and also press the bell icon so that you get every update every first so thank you thank you very much yes 12 stay connected till next video